Hi friends, uh, in this video, I'm going to show you one peculiar issue with uh, Flutter web when you try to connect to a REST API. So in this example, uh, you can see I'm using a very basic uh, uh, URI, which is, uh, which, is going, uh, which is calling a REST uh, API. And then I'm creating a HTTP client and trying to get the response using a get method okay so if i try to execute this in chrome so this is my chrome which is started here so it gives you a username and password so i can enter a username here just for example i'm just putting one two three and password also one two three so when i click on the login button i'm calling this um, a submit method i'm doing a connection to this uh, uh, the rest api just for an example so when i click on login you can see the username entered is one two three so which is coming here username entered one two three and uh, password entered is also one two three from this login page and it straight away throws a weird error xml http request error so which comes from this exception so it doesn't go through the the connection successful connection but, uh, but the weird thing is, uh, it works very well with your uh, uh, simulators. If you try to simulate the same thing uh, on an iPhone, I'm going to start the iPhone 12 mini. Let me try to show you how it works uh, perfectly fine with the mobile. So I'm pushing the code to uh, mobile so this is my mobile version of the same screen so I'm trying to again hit the login button so I just give the same pass some password 123 and 123 click on login you see here the password username entered is 123 password is 1223 which I entered here and then you have pressed login button from mobile and it, it directly gives the response from the server. So response from the server, the response, I123, which I'm returning from the server. But why it doesn't work in the case of a browser, in the case of a, a web browser support from the Flutter. So I almost um, did a lot of research on this and then uh, and I spent almost four to five hours. That's the reason I'm creating this video. So after so much of time, I found this is not a client issue. This is a server side issue. So this is fixed by just one single uh, entry on the server in your Spring Boot API. So I'll show you what is the fix. You'll be surprised. So I'm going to my server. So I'm in the server now. I'm in the remote server. So you can see here, this is my, the actual method which returning hi123 which is a request mapping with a URI smart pro slash hi. Okay. So here we need to implement cross origin uh, resource uh, sharing uh, permission. So CORS shortly known as course. So there is annotation to do that. So I just need to enable that annotation. So this is the annotation here for your controller for any controller you can give it. It, it applies to all the methods in that controller. So I just you uh, cross origin max ages in seconds. So even if you don't give the max age also no problem. So once I do this, I just try to save it and then restart my uh, web service. So I'm restarting it now. So once it is restarted, so I go, that's the only change I have done, right? So I go back to my, uh, Android Studio and then try to push the code back to back to the browser. So now I launched it again in the browser. Let us try to call the same web service. Okay, so I'm clicking this. You can see here it straight away gives me the hi one two three response from some server. So that's it. So it works it works fine with the browser. So the issue is solved. So in a nutshell, if you enter, uh, if you if you have this issue, uh, your uh, your Flutter, the moment you change your uh, 
uh, your app to web flutter web from the mobile so you may have surprises that the http connections don't work so the issue is not on the client side the issue is on the server side you have to go and change your uh, uh, server side code it may be python if, if it's a python you need to change it in the flask if it is um, uh, spring boot you need to give that annotation cross origin annotation in the spring boot i hope this video helps you to resolve this issue if you are stuck and um, thanks for watching bye bye